still continue to pray, but our prayers was mostly unheard, unanswered, because the highest God doesn't want humans to continue to war with each other and to murder and torture other beings like the animal people and destroy the planet by raising animal people for meat and cutting trees at random the size of football fields every day. Yes. 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 How much longer can the world, can the earth sustain us if we continue this way? Spewing methane into the air to contaminate the air that we breathe and chemicals and poisons flowing into our drinking water by chemical things, pesticides and all that. Yes. Yes. Killing animal people just to eat, just to stuff it down the throat with bloody guts and torturing animal people before killing, burning them alive, roasting them alive and oh. cutting their throats and torturing them with all kinds of things, stealing their mother's milk and torturing animal people, innocent, helpless, imprisoned animal people in the laboratory, just for cosmetics even. Yes. How would any God with fairness, judgment, support that? Would help this kind of brutal race of human beings? I understand, Master. We cannot blame the gods for not answering our prayers. We cannot blame anyone except ourselves because we live brutally. So we will earn brutal outcomes. Oh my God, terrible for everybody. I wish they just all listen. It's so simple, just be vegan even. Not to talk about being enlightened. Just be vegan, make peace. That's all. There's not much to ask, is it? No, Master. And we have plenty of vegetables to eat. And nowadays they even make meat-like types of protein and everything. They have everything they need. They don't need to torture the helpless, innocent beings that just to drink their blood to eat their flesh. This is so terrible. Even the so-called religious people do that. How can ordinary people learn anything from anyone? Yes, yes, yes. yes. yes.